Hey guys, I'm starting off the vlog right now. It is Vlogmas day one. It's about 4.45 in the morning and I just woke up and got out of bed. And this is what I do on my typical day. And I go from my bed and I switch and I go to the couch and I sleep for just a little bit longer. So that's just what I'm about to do. So when I finally wake up for the day, we'll start to get ready and we'll head out shopping for the day. It's about nine o'clock now and I just woke up again. So it's time to get ready. So I'm going to go ahead and pick out my outfit and do my makeup. So my outfit is quite simple. I'm just going to go with this old navy sweatshirt and some black leggings. Okay, now for my makeup. This is how I store my makeup. I keep all my ones that I'm keeping in here. And this is my declutter bag that I just filmed yesterday. And these are my makeup brushes. Hello. And we're going to use this to do my makeup today because I still have to, I still have yet to pick out my new routine. And that's probably gonna come up soon because it is December 1st, of course. I'm just gonna do a really fast makeup routine because we're just going shopping and I really don't put on a lot of makeup for shopping. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put on some priming spray. You can use this for um, priming or setting your face. Then for my under eyes and a little bit on my face, I'm gonna take some concealer. I don't really like this concealer for around my face, but I'm just gonna make it work today. I want to go ahead and put on some Morphe bronzer. I do love this stuff. Hey, sweet girl. Hey, sweet girl. Mm. <laughs> now I'm going to use some of this Hourglass highlighting stick with just my finger. I'm just going to rub it on my finger and then just go ahead and apply it. What? What are you doing? Jack now I'm going to take some eyeshadow and just run this through my crease. Now to apply some simple brow gel. I'm just getting smoky. <laughs> <laughs> and then next we're going to apply this MAC Magic Extension Mascara, of which I absolutely despise. Why do I hate it? Yeah. Because it sucks. Smell it. <laughs> She's on the fan. Yeah, she's gonna crap on me. <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if she just pooped on me? No! <laughs> yeah. Pick you my cards, Mom. I got pick you my fans that came me. Pick my cards. And then lastly for my lips, I'm taking the Skin Chemist Lip Plumper, which doesn't really plump your lips, but it makes them look really good. And then... And that's all for my quick shopping makeup routine. We're on our way shopping guys, so we're stopping at the gas station first to fill up the truck with some diesel and then we're about to get on the highway and start shopping. So I don't know where we're going first, but we have got about five places to go today. So once we get to our first place, I'll show you where we get to and it's going to be a lot of fun. So our first stop is this little plaza right here and we're going to that store right there called the Vapor Shop. We're just going to grab some vape juice and I'm not going into this one. My husband just ran in to grab some. This is really such a cute store though. It's a small mom and pop prior military owned store. So they have some really good deals and they do give a military discount. And I love how they have it set up in there. It is absolutely adorable. And you can always get some free coffee when you go in. Look what it is, guys. It's Alta. Too bad we're not going there today, but I wish. So here's our next two stops, Dollar Tree and Five Below. They're right next to each other. So I'm going to run into Dollar Tree while my husband and daughter go into Five Below for a little bit. I don't need anything at Five Below, so I just need stuff at Dollar Tree. I changed my mind. I'm going to Five Below to see what they have in here. I'm filling up the cart. I got some good stuff so far. I'm in the beauty section right now and yeah, I'm in heaven pretty much. The fragrance section at Five Below is my favorite. They have some really good stuff here and I always bring one home with me. All right, this is self checkout here. So here's our cart. I'm going to do a haul when we get home. So we're going to go through everything that we got. All right, we just put all the Five Below stuff in the truck. So now we're headed to Dollar Tree to go get a few little grocery things. So we're not gonna be in here long and it's just gonna be a little bit boring stuff, really. But I'll show you what we get when we're at the checkout. So here's our baskets. We did this probably in about 10 minutes. We got everything really, really quick. 
Okay guys, sorry about that car alarm, but our next stop would be Target. We have a couple things to get in here and we're just gonna look around a little bit. So I'm in the snack nut section and these large ones are on sale for $14 and usually at Walmart they're like $18 or $19. So that's a really, really good deal. So I grabbed me some of those. So we did all the hygiene shopping. Now we're just looking down the toy aisle to see if we find anything cool. Perfect condition, but fire. Look, there's some other dogs. All right guys, we made it to the last place on our list today. This is Hobby Lobby and they're running a 60% off Christmas clearance sale. So we're gonna go see what Christmas decorations we can get. Hopefully it's good. I haven't been in here in a long time. The nutcrackers over there. I'm going to make a little right down the road. It's a secretary. Emotion. Paint a happy little face on it. I really want that. Oh god, okay, I'm good. I'm just getting some Christmas decorations while I'm here and looking around at all their cute stuff. They have so many good things. All right, we were in and out of Hobby Lobby pretty quick because it was packed. There were so many people in there. We spent more time waiting in line than we actually did shopping. It's all because they were having that great Christmas sale that I'm telling you about. But we ended up getting some cute Christmas decorations and I'll show you all that when we get home. Oh, this part's gonna be fun. Hey Georgia, it's time to vote. Early voting runs through Friday, December 2nd. Find your voting location at IWillVote.com. You can also vote on election day, Tuesday, December 6th. Our future is on the line, so get in the line and stay in the line. We're counting on your vote. I've heard there was a secret code the day the Hey guys, I am home finally and I have this huge haul here to show you. We have a lot to go through, so let's get started, shall we? And I also remember to keep all my receipts this time so I can give you the actual prices of things. Okay, so I'm gonna go in order of the places that we went. So the first place we went was the Vapor Shop. So we ended up picking up three different flavors of vape juice this time. My husband got this one called Shamrock from Savoy, and this one is really good. It tastes like Thin Men's Girl Scout cookies. And then I got this one called Great Conundrum. I hate the name of it, but I do like this one. And then for backup, we got this really cheap one called Candy Cane, and this one's just okay. And then we both need coils. My husband gets the point three, and I get the point two. And all that stuff should last us the majority of the month, and it came up to $114. The next store we went to was Five Below, and we got a whole bunch of fun stuff there, so let's get to that. I'm gonna go through this bag first, because this is that little beauty bag thing that I got. So I got these chakra incense and it has the crown, third eye, throat, heart, solar plexus, sacral, and root. And it has scents like lotus, jasmine, eucalyptus, rose, lavender, ylang ylang, and cedar. I don't know if these are gonna be any good, but I love incense. And I also got another incense. This is called Feel the Breeze and I actually wanna try these out right now. So let me go get my incense stuff. Okay, so I got my incense holder and my lighter. So let's try it. Here's what they come packaged like. They are purple, that's pretty cool. And these smell so, so good. The scent on this is sea salt, pineapple, and cashmere. You get 30 incense sticks in here, and I think this was $4. So all you do is light the little tip of it. And I'm just gonna stick this in my little incense holder. 
So here's my new Feel the Breeze incense going. And this incense smells lovely so far. It actually smells good. I'm excited to try all these too. In this one, you get seven packs with 10 in each pack. So you get 70 in this one. And this was $4 as well. Trey, come show the camera what you're doing. Show the camera you don't know how to tighten your hair. That was a mistake. Then the next thing I got are these really cute purple kitten socks. I usually go barefoot every day, but I've been trying to wear socks every single day to keep my feet in better condition. In fact, I'm wearing socks right now. I have little Easter peep socks on. I love peeps. So these socks were $1. And then of course, I couldn't leave there without looking at the makeup. So I got two pieces of makeup from LA Colors. The first thing I got is this little lemon drop palette. So it looks like we have some similar looking shades in here, but I did want to play with this. I love LA Colors makeup and this looks really fun to use. I actually want to open this up and try a few swatches really quick. So here's what the palette looks like open. I love that it has a little depth amongst the yellow. So here's a few quick swatches of this palette and I must say I'm pretty impressed just by swatching it. All the shades work pretty well. I've never tried an LA Colors eyeshadow palette before and I think this was only $3. So I love these colors all together and I'm excited to use this. And then next we have this lip oil by LA Colors and this says it's infused with gold in the shade Honey Bun. So let's go ahead and give this a try too. The packaging on this is really nice and you can see the little gold flakes on the inside. And this smells like baked goods. Guys, this is a really nice lip oil. I'm excited to have this and continue using this. I don't have very many lip oils in my collection just because I'm not really into lip oils in general, but this kind of called out to me, so... I'm loving it. Okay, in the next bag, we have some blue heat Takis. These are for my son. He loves all things Taki, so these are for him. And then we got some Squishmallows. So this one is a Beluga Whale, and this is Laszlo. This one is for my daughter. She loves Squishmallows just as much as I do. And this one is for me. This one is Mary Beth, and it's a little octopus. If you didn't know this, I collect all sorts of octopi Squishmallows. I also like the cat ones, too. So if I ever find a cat or an octopus, I always try to pick it up. And then this is the last bag from Five Below. We got a couple packs of these little mini brands. This is a Disney edition. And then my daughter has all of these that she already Wait. had opened up. Show them my favorite one. Okay, let me find it. This is my favorite one. It's a Revlon Color Stay Foundation. And then we also got a couple of these pet simulator goodie bags. And this is what they look like on the inside. So here's what this looks like. And you get a little keychain with a little pet on it. Some bags are lucky and you get a little redemption code that you can use to, for something lucky in game. Like so here's a receipt for that one. It was one pen. Next we have Dollar Tree and that's where I got all those snacks at. So I'm going to go ahead and lay all the snacks out and then do a pan so I can just go through each one like that instead of holding it up. Okay, so here's everything we got at Dollar Tree as far as snacks goes. We didn't go full-fledged grocery shopping. We're going to save that for another day. But everything you see here was only $1.25. And we shopped for all this in about 10 minutes flat because we're kind of in a rush today. So we grabbed some original SpaghettiOs, some chicken noodle soup, some sugar wafers. Of course, these Girl Scout dupe cookies. These are so good. Some gum, some powdered sugar donuts, some Ritz dupes. And you cannot go to Dollar Tree without getting some of these egg rolls. My husband's eating some now. These are so freaking delicious. And then some cereal in the back right there. And then the toasty cheese crackers, some little pop tarts, some of these um, Cheetos macaroni and cheeses. And then my son loves these chicken ramen bowls. And then we have some of these Nutty Buddy bars. You put these in the freezer and they are so good. And then if you've never tried this cheese ravioli from Dollar Tree, we just had this for the first time the other day. You don't get a whole bunch in the bag, but if you cook two bags, it's good enough for a dinner and it is so delicious. And then we picked up four of these chimichangas from, from El Monterey. And then my whole family loves eating these Vienna sausages, but I think they're disgusting. And then we got some cheese, some fruit snacks, a couple of these fast bite cheeseburger and chicken sandwiches. I always like to look for the spicy chicken sandwiches for my son, but they were completely out of them today. So that was a little strange, but we did find the normal chicken sandwiches. And I think I covered everything except these little sandwich bags. We are out of sandwich bags, so I needed to grab some of those. And for the egg rolls, we got vegetable, we got chicken, we got shrimp, and we got lobster ones. So 
four different types and that's it for all of our groceries. So I'm gonna go ahead and put all of these up because we've got some cold things in here, some things that go in the freezer and I'll be back to show you the rest of the bags. So here's my receipt for Dollar Tree and we spent $66. Now, let me tell you about my anxiety problem at Dollar Tree. So we always get a bunch of snacks while we're there. Sometimes we get a whole cart full, sometimes even more than that. And every time we're at the checkout line, we get a whole line built up behind us of people that only have the, like one or two items that are just trying to run in quick and grab something and get out. And obviously since we have like a hundred things, it takes us quite a while to check out and we get glared at so, so bad. And it's so anxiety inducing that it just makes me nervous going in there all the time. My husband says it doesn't phase him in the slightest, but it does bother me. So I always like to go more times and get smaller amounts of things and just kind of travel there in smaller batches. Okay, the next store we went to was Target today. So let's see what we got from Target. We did get some Christmas tree cakes. These are holiday limited edition. You can only get them around this time of the year. This is my family's all time favorite snack. They get these all the time and they love them. I recently saw on Pinterest how to make a dip out of this. So I've been interested in seeing if I can do that because I think they would really like it. And then I showed you guys this in store because this was a fantastic deal. These nuts were on sale for $14. And usually if you buy something like this at Walmart, it's around $20. So these are the sea salt roasted whole cashews and I eat nuts every single day. I love them so much. So cashews are my favorite. So I always get the big hunk of junk with this. I also got the Good and Gather cashew halves and pieces. These were also on sale and I like the little bitty ones as well. And then I picked up the Blue Diamond Almonds. These are the lightly salted variety. I was looking for the normal salted variety, but they didn't have those in stock. All they had were the lightly salted ones. So I figured this was better than nothing. And Blue Diamond makes the best tasting almonds in my opinion. Sometimes after I eat dinner, I want a snack. I don't eat too much processed food, but I do like these little Quest bars. These are the dipped chocolate chip cookie dough, and these have only one gram of sugar per bar. So I do like these. They're quite delicious if you ask me. But I prefer the actual cookie dough ones. These are cookie dough ones. They just have chocolate. The, These not, are the same thing, but they have chocolate around them. I'll try that one. Next, we got the 200 milligram ibuprofen. <laughs> if you get the off brand, you can save yourself a ton of money and it does the exact same thing. And then again, we got the 650 milligram fake off brand Tylenol. And this again, does the same thing. It just saves you a bunch of money if you go the up and up brand. We also grabbed some caffeine tablets. Now, let me tell you a little story about this. I don't go to Target very often, so I'm really unfamiliar with the pharmacy section. And every single store I go to puts their caffeine supplements in different areas, so I never know where to find these. So I asked one lady who was stocking things around the pharmacy section where these were located, and I said, do you know where the caffeine supplements are? And she asked me, what is caffeine? Is that something for your hair? I was a little taken back by that because I've never met anybody who didn't know what caffeine was. So since she couldn't help me find what I was looking for, I found another employee who was working in the aisle and he didn't know what caffeine was. So he had to look it up on his phone. So I had to say the name brand of Viverin. I didn't want the name brand. I just wanted the Target brand, but this is the only one that they could look up to find. So I had to get this one. So here's what I got. That's my long story about getting these expensive caffeines. I got some secret deodorant. This is in the scent completely clean. So let's smell this. I can't smell anything actually. This smells quite lovely. So I love secret deodorants. I think they make the best deodorants. I usually get the secret aluminum free, but when I was at Target, I saw the price of the aluminum free ones were $12. So I quickly said, I'll take the aluminum and this was $5. So I saved myself $7 by just getting the normal one. I also ran out of mouthwash, so I just got my normal Glamorous White mouthwash. And my husband also ran out of mouthwash, so he gets the Enamel Care mouthwash. This is his favorite. And lastly from Target, I picked up this Microband 24-hour multi-purpose cleaner for around the house. Call me a sucker if you will, but I keep seeing commercials for this on YouTube, and it kind of drew me into it, so I really wanted to pick this up and try it. So here's a receipt from Target and our total was 121 for Target. So now we're down to our last store and if you remember that would be Hobby Lobby. Now like I said that place was jam-packed with about 8,000 people in it so we went in and out in about five minutes but the longest time we spent in there was waiting in line. 
So my goal was to go in there and look for some Christmas decor because I plan on decorating my house this year. I don't really go full out or anything because I'm just not really a holiday type person, but I did want to have just a few things around the house for the kids to enjoy the Christmas time. So everything in Hobby Lobby right now is 60% off for all their seasonal stuff. So the first thing I picked up was this really cute tree and it has some little ornaments all around it and it's spray painted with some fake snow on there and some glitter. And the original price of this was $18.99, which is absolutely ridiculous. I would never pay that, but I did get this for 60% off. So we're going to use this to decorate with this year, of course. And the next thing I picked up was this really cute, flimsy gingerbread man. He just sits there and then he just wobbles back and forth. And the original price on this guy was $9.99, but he was 60% off too. And this was on my Christmas wish list this year. I really wanted to get a nutcracker for Christmas decoration. So I did find one. They didn't have a bunch of different ones. I really wanted to get, get a pink or purple one, but they only had blue or red and you could pick between the drummer or there was another one. I don't remember what it was, but I like the drummer one the best. So if you move his little back piece, his mouth moves. And I think he just looks really cool for Christmas. So those are the three pieces I got at Hobby Lobby and here's our receipt and we paid $25 for all three pieces. I also forgot to tell you that the Nutcracker was originally $25.99. So that's all the shopping we did today and I also came home and my husband got checked the mail and I got an Ipsy bag in there. I don't know if this is add-ons or what's in here so let's open it up and find out. So it is some add-ons. I'm excited about these. Let's open them up and see exactly what this is. So the first thing we got is from Kevin Acoin and this is called the Strict Nude Skin Tint. So we just got a little sample of that. I figured it was enough to try and get my feelings on anyway. And the second thing we have is some Context Nude Balm and I love the lip products. I'm not really a big lip product person but I do like this brand. I think their lip products are really nice and oh look at this it's actually a duo so let's see what colors we got if they're both let's the duo. new colors so here's both the shades in the new duo so i'm gonna go ahead and swatch these for you so here's what they look like right here you can see that the red obviously has more pigment than the brown color but i do like them they're just a little hint of color they're pretty much basically sheer so that's all i have for the haul right now i'll be back to check in in a little bit Oh, look at this little baby. Look who's spending time with me. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, guys, so I did some laundry and I'm gonna have a little something for dinner. I'm not gonna do a full-fledged dinner tonight. So it's six o'clock, so I'm just gonna end the vlog here so I have time to edit it and get it up tonight. And I have a lot planned for tomorrow, so get ready for tomorrow's video. We have a lot to do. I hope you enjoyed this video and that you also had a good day. And if you liked this video, please give me a giant thumbs up. And if you didn't like this video, just hit that thumbs down button. And until next time, bye.